Okay, you guys, so I'm here in TJ Maxx, and I had to turn down the volume because that music was so loud. But you can see they have these MAC nude lipsticks for $7.99, the full vial, $7.99 for MAC lipsticks. And they had a lot of different colors. Now, they had the, also the minis for $4.99. I only saw those in Chile, but those are the minis. They're the small ones. But $4.99, you guys, you can't beat that. They also had Anastasia. They had the lip glasses. They had Clinique, NARS. You guys, go check out the makeup, makeup section at your local TJ Maxx and see what you can find because they had a lot of goodies marked down to almost nothing. Go check it out. You guys like bath bombs? Check these out. They got all these bath bombs. I have a lot of these already, so I probably won't get any, but they got a array of different kind of bath bombs. Okay, you guys, so these, they have some more of this um, smart foam. It's still $5.99. I haven't tried the one that I have yet, but I am interested in trying it out. And I'll be letting you guys know. Yeah. Target and oh my goodness I have been looking for this lotion oh my goodness yes because I'm out of it and I love the way it smells so I'm definitely gonna grab that and this orange one smells so good but I don't have the shower gel to go with that one that's called black tea kombucha and red ginger it smells really good kind of spicy just like it sounds so let's see how this one smells that one has a nice smell too but I have I have the shower gels and bath bombs that go to this one so that's the one I'm going to get okay you guys I just wanted to show you what I said in my last video about the $3.99 these are the days that they're $6.19 and it is a much smaller bottle. Let's look at the weight of this. Okay, this is 3.8 ounces. So just so you know, I was really telling the truth. I have to show you the size of my other bottle once I get home. But yes, that is 3.8 ounces and it says $6.19. All right, so here's the Dove that I was telling you that I got at TJ Maxx. And I'm just going to show you, again, you see it's $3.99 and it's 250 milliliters. So I didn't know exactly how much that translated to in ounces. So I'm going to insert a um, screen recording of how much that is. Hold on. Okay, so you guys saw with your own eyes the comparison. You can get the large at CJ Maxx for $3.99 for 8.45 ounces. Whereas at Target, the um, three point, I think it was 3.8 ounces, it was $6.19. And like I was telling you in my last video, I usually get it for about $5.99 or $4.99. So I went back, when I went back the other day to check to see if I could get more, they all were gone. So you have to grab them while you can because um, people are on it now. And then you also saw the lipsticks, the MAC, the Clinique, the Anastasia. It's something to check into. I don't know if they're always the colors that you want, but whenever you're in there, just kind of check over there and see um, what they have that offers for as lipsticks. But let's go ahead and get to it. I think I'm gonna go ahead and start with Walmart. The things that I got at Walmart that were different um, that I wanna try. The first one was this Ivory. As you guys can see, Ivory has changed their packaging and this Ivory has a hint of cotton. It smells really good. I um, was trying to pick out which one I really like. I like the cotton one. It's really clean 
and um, it has a nice scent. Now they had one that was like coconutty. Oh, now that one smelled good too, but I already have so much coconut stuff. I was like, let me try this um, hint of cotton. So this is the one that I got. I know this was under $4. I'm not sure if it was $3.99 or $3.69 or something like that. But this is the Ivory and it's Hint of Cotton. It has a really nice smell. And Ivory always does get you clean, you guys. So if you're looking for something that's not so expensive, it's a little bit on the cheaper side. But it does give a good cleanse. This is something that um, you might want to try. I used ivory before. I've used the liquid ivory, but it looked different. So I, when I saw this, I'm like, let me try this one. So, yep, that's the one thing that I got, the ivory and hint of cotton. The next thing that I got was this Caress Daily Silk. I love this stuff. I always get this because I like the smell of it. Um, it's white peach and orange blossom, and it does leave your skin feeling silky smooth. So... I love the scent of this. It just has a very nice scent. Now, this is my favorite caress that I like. This is the one that I get, and it's the Daily Silk, and it's the Floral Oil Essence. And you know the, the um, caress, they're never really expensive. It was pretty inexpensive. The next thing that I got was the um, OGX. I've seen a lot of people use this. Now, this one is the um, Decadent Aroma, and it smells so good, y'all. Uh, it's, it's like coconutty, coconutty. It reminds me of my Bum Bum Cream. I have the, uh, the Turquoise Bum Bum Cream. It reminds me of that. I really love the smell of this one. This is the um, OGX. This is my first time trying this, but uh, this is another one that I wanted to try out was the OGX. Now this, I love Dove products. I love Dove products. This right here is the Dove Body Wash Mousse. And it is in rose oil because I told y'all I love rose. I love the smell of rose. So, um, and it's two, two times the uses. So we'll see. This one was a little bit more expensive. Um, I'm believing this one's like $6.99. But this one was a little bit more expensive, but it's definitely worth a try. And, um, yep, I'm going to go ahead and give this a try. This is the Dove, and this is the Body Wash Mousse, where you can shape it into your hand and use it. So, this is something that I haven't been trying. I had one. I got one of from Soap and Glory in my last haul, and this is going to be the, um, the Dove. I'm going to try these mousses to see how I like them, to see if I like it better. Does it use as much? Uh, is it is it um, cheaper to buy the mousse? Is it cheaper to buy the soap? Because it seems like that's becoming a thing now is the mousse. So I'm going to try those out. Now this one I was really surprised about. Y'all know South Soap is always cheap. It's not very expensive. I, don't, I know it was like $3 or something like that. But this one is a limited edition Mardi Gras. And so I was just going through all of them smelling them like, hmm, it's regular stuff. You know, it's regular schmegler. But I got to this one. Y'all, this has a nice smell to it. It's limited edition. I'm thinking about going back and give me a couple more because it just smells really good. And I can't put my finger on it. You can see it has like mandarin oranges on the front, but it doesn't smell orangey at all. It's kind of perfumey. And maybe it's jasmine. I don't know, like a jasmine smell. But, yeah, maybe it's, I don't know, maybe it's jasmine and orange or something. I don't know. I don't smell orange at all. But this right here, I think I'm going to go get another one. It says limited edition, but I like the smell of that soft soap. It's soft soap. And it's really cheap. This is the only one I was like, oh, I got to have that one. So, I don't like just buying stuff to be buying it. I got to have it. If I'm going to get it, I'm going to have to really try it. Or I know I like it. Or I know it's a good product. Because I don't have money to be just buying stuff. Now, this is another thing that I get. I don't know if you guys use these, but they're flushable wipes. We were out of those. So, I just snagged these. They were like $3.99, three pack. That's a good deal, too. So, all of this was from Walmart. Okay, so the next thing I'm going to move on to is back to TJ Maxx. This is the Pure Castile Soap, and this is in um, Hemp Rose. This is great 
great for cleansing your body it's great for cleansing you guys i love this i usually get the small one but this big one right here was 11.99 isn't that a good buy they're usually like 15 16 20 dollars sometimes it depends on where you get it from and this is the pure castile soap and rose so yep i got this one Now, this is something different from what I normally get. Okay, so when I'm taking a bath, I really enjoy a good foaming bubble bath. So, these are something that I wanted to try. It's called Positive Mind Life. And they have these different vials of different vials right here. Of bubble bath. Okay, and so we have White Orchard and Lily Blossom Bubble Bath. White tea, rose, and ginger bubble bath, and olive oil and lemon peel, ocean breeze and driftwood, sweet lavender, and yank lang lang. So I'm gonna give these a try. Then it has a calming jasmine lotion. So I love the smell of jasmine. I'm gonna give these a try just to um, have a different, um, a different bubble bath, just to try those out. And the next thing that I got was this headband because I'm always doing my facials and y'all can see I got a lot of hair, I got a lot of hair. I have to pull this stuff back and keep it out of my way when I'm doing my facials or when I'm getting a bath, just a beauty routine. I like to have a headband and I thought this one was really cute. So I snagged this one up. And I think it was for, this was $4.99. It was $4.99, but it's a big one. Let me go ahead and open it so you guys can see. You'll probably be seeing this on my skin routines. But isn't that cute? So cute and it's soft. It's really soft. So that's what I got to uh, keep my hair out of my face when I'm doing a skin routine. Next, you guys, I love, love a good smell of soap. Mmm. This one smells so good, and this is by Castle Bell Milk and Honey Scented. And it has a little rabbit with a little cottontail on the front. I think it's so cute. But the smell of it, I had a hard time picking which one I wanted. But um, these are expensive to me because it was like, oh, here's the price right here. It's $3.99. That's what I thought. It's $3.99, but, you know, the soap does last for a minute because, like I mentioned before, I always do my first wash with a soap and a, a towel. And then my second wash is always a, um, a shower gel. So, I definitely want to give this one a try. I haven't tried this. It's called Milk and Honey Scented. But if you just smell their soaps, they have some really good smelling soaps in them. Um, yeah, I always get one, but I don't ever get the same one. I like to try something different. Now, I mentioned this in my last haul that I don't have this one. This is the Foaming Body Scrub. And like I mentioned in my last, I had um, the other two fragrances. This one I don't have. It is sweet like honey. And this one smells so good. I had to pick it up. They had a, a couple more that I didn't have, but I didn't like the smell. If I didn't like the smell, I didn't get it. But this one smells so good. It's sweet like honey. And it is in honey and lavender. That's what it is. Honey and lavender. And it smells really good. It's a nice mixture. I wouldn't think to put those two things together. But it smells really good. So I'm going to be making a video on how I'm layering these, um, these hygiene products, you guys. Because a lot of them have the same smell. If you smell it and it smells similar to your soap or your lotion, go ahead and try layering those together and that'll give you a more overall effect because if your scrub, your lotion, your soap, your body spray, if all of that has the same smell, it's just gonna have you smelling wonderful, smelling wonderful. So that's what I like to do is layer my products. And so this one is one I'm going to be interested in, in using. The fact that it's a foaming body scrub is amazing. It feels so much better. Grains that are uh, exfoliating your skin because this is foamy and it's a gentler exfoliation. So 
If you see these at TJ Maxx, you better grab it up. It's only $5.99. And um, I know a lot of people say that they get the smaller one, a much smaller one at Walmart, and it's more expensive than this. And this one right here is 20 ounces for $5.99. So if you see these, you wanna give them a try. Okay, and last but not least, I went to Target. I showed you guys the pictures of what I um, was looking at at Target, but I'm gonna show you what I did get. And that is the Love, Beauty, and Planet Lotion. Now, I'm gonna show you why I got this. I've been a huge fan of Love, Beauty, and Planet, but I went to Dollar General probably six months ago, about six months ago, and look at this. Ten dollars. Ten dollars. I got four of them. I've already used two of them up. <laughs> but I love the smell of this one. This is the um, Mumuru Butter and Rose. And when I tell you guys, the smell and the feel that this gives you is amazing. And this kit for ten dollars, you get uh, these bath bombs. And it's two big bath bombs. And then this is the body wash. And you also get the scrubber. You get the scrubber. All of this was $10 at Dollar General. So if you're ever in Dollar General, you never know. You might just happen upon this. But it doesn't have the lotion or the deodorant. And I purchased the others before. So I've been looking for them at Walmart. Walmart obviously doesn't carry it anymore. So at Target, guess what? That's why I guess Walmart's not carrying it because Target done took it. Okay, but here it is right here. And now this was, it was higher than it was at Walmart, I think. I think this was $6.99 at Target. I think I remember getting this for $4.99, $5.99 at Walmart, but not sure. But yeah. And also, here's the deodorant. That's a layer for you right there. That's a layer for you. And when I tell you, this stuff smells so good. It smells so good. This is my favorite scent. They have the cotton one. I guess everybody has their own scent. But for my chemistry, mm, this smells so good. This is for my chemistry. This is the one that I like to use. And that's the um, Mamumaru Boot Butter and Rose. And um, Love Bath and Planet, they make some good stuff, you guys. And they're natural products. I want to get more into natural products let me just put it that way because not right now i'm not that picky about it i kind of just if i like what i like if i like it i get it you know what i'm saying but that's i do want to kind of start looking into the more natural things because i think it is healthier i think it does um you know help you become more of a healthy person but um yeah i don't know i just like what i like so i don't know if you guys are like me or not but that's how it is but that's the end of it you guys i appreciate you guys stopping by and you know uh looking at these products with me go out and give them a a, a view like i said before um you can really save some money when you just shop around and sometimes the unexpected like who expect mac lipstick clinique lipstick anastasia lipstick up in tj maxx you know what i'm saying i know every now and then i'll run across some i'm not gonna lie i run across one or two twos but they had a whole section of that day i just don't need any more makeup as you can see i got makeup everywhere i got lipsticks everywhere i got stuff everywhere but it seems like you guys really enjoyed the last one and i wanted to put another one out there real quick but um yeah just let me know what you thought about it let me know what products that um you want to see if i do come across them i'll you know i'll do a video on it and let you know and uh, as far as the smell or whatever just let me know what you think and um if you're new to my channel i want to welcome you here i do have a lot of new subscribers too and guess what i'm coming up on a hundred uploads so with that um with that being said i'm going to have a giveaway pretty soon it's going to be some nice things i haven't decided exactly uh what i'm going to put in it but um you can check back on my last one and um, there were some nice things that I put in there. But this one, I want to make it even better. You guys, it's it's not easy, but um, I'm staying consistent. I'm trying to, to do my best and I appreciate you guys coming along with me for the ride. Uh, just want to let you know how much I appreciate you and thank you. And I'll be putting out um, 
when the giveaway is. I'll be leaving instructions on how you can enter the giveaway. So make sure you enter it. Make sure you go ahead and subscribe so that you'll be eligible. But now that doesn't mean everybody can win. That doesn't mean everybody can win. So don't subscribe because you don't win, okay? Because there will be more giveaways. There are gonna be more and hopefully they'll be better. Comment down below and let me know your name. Um, let me know how you found me. And um, yeah, I appreciate you stopping by. And you guys take care and I'll be seeing you soon. Thank you.